Hey everybody, we've got another little improvement to the site, uh, and this is with the code export mode. Uh, so I'm on an old version of the site right now. If I go into the view code version of the site, uh, you can just see that there's just a wall of code thrown at you. And uh, maybe you don't know what to do with it because you didn't write the website. So you're just coming in and here's a block of code. Cool. Uh, there are some steps that you need to follow, and I started us down the path of telling you a few of those steps. So now, this is on the newer version of the site, if you come over to the code export. Well, first off, it's not this, I don't know, I mean, maybe you like this color scheme better, but I think this one's a little bit cleaner, it's a little bit lighter. Um, and we have a couple of steps. Uh, the first step is to download the library that I've made, Superblock, and then some other dependencies. Uh, so you can just hit this to copy them, and then in your terminal you'll do that in your project and add whatever, add all of these. You might already have a lot of them, you might have none of them. Uh, so you'll need to copy all those. And then once you know where to put all of the code for a particular page into your app, you can uh, well, you could just drag and copy all of that, or you could just hit this little clipboard over here. Now it's copied, uh, and then you would find your page that you need to put it all in, and then you could just copy-paste. And then you would have, ideally, if you already have your site up and working, you would just now have a new page on your website. Um, I'm kind of ignoring a lot of steps. Uh, I'm just assuming that you have your own site already up and running. Um, there are a bunch of different ways to get a site up and running that accepts React code. Uh, I will plan on adding some guides on how to do that for various frameworks, uh, but there's, you can use Create, create React App, you can use Create Next App, you can use React Static, maybe you already have a site up and running, maybe you're using Gatsby. Um, I'll add a few what are the actual steps if I have one of these running, but for right now I'm just ignoring those, hand-waving it away, assuming that you have something that you know and how, and you know how to add a page to it. And then these are the actual two steps that you need to complete. Uh, after this, you should be good to go. So that's all we've got for today. Thanks. See you next time.